Coming up later, if you're a woman over 40, Kim Douglas has makeup ideas to make you look and feel younger. Well, we're all excited around here. As you may know by now, this summer, Paige Hemis and her fiancé, Jason Short, will be getting married on our show in a two-hour primetime special right here. And today, we're talking wedding invitations with Paige and her wedding planner, our very own Debbie Metanopoulos. So, Paige, how are you feeling? About I'm feeling this? so excited. Yeah. I can't believe, I've won. I feel blessed and amazed that I get to come to work every day, oh, no. share the most important day with the people I love the most in this world, and... Oh, it's so fun. It's so fun that this is actually my job now for the next two months. With you. Countdown to the yes. wedding. I know it's yeah. a lot of fun. I know. It's a lot of fun. So where is it, where do you start? We were talking invitations here. Yes. Where do we start, Debbie? Well, the invitation is not just when you're going to tell your guest mm -hmm. the time and the date of the wedding. It's also the time that you're going to let the guests know if it's going to be a, a, a formal wedding, if it's going to be a more chill wedding. So when you go to get your invitations as a bride or a wedding planner that's going to get them, they should know the theme of the wedding before you even go out. And as you can see here, we have some beautiful invitations from Hallmark. You can get all of these from Hallmark online. There's a floral theme. There's a rustic theme. There's a modern theme, nautical. Um, there's one that's more, more dressy and more modern and dressed up and more some that are more like country chic. And I like that us. Mr. and Mrs. Exactly. And you can and even... That customize them with pictures we took those off your phone you did not know no thank no. you <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow yeah but i mean there's this is the time that you should let your guests know what the wedding's going to be sure excellent now, can we ask you what your theme for your wedding is or is it a yes. secret no it's not a secret okay. i'm going to share it with all of you because okay. you're going to be doing diys with me yes, we are. hopefully all yes all yeah. uh the the theme i'm going with is rustic chic so that's kind of like an elegant but mm. rustic thing at the same time if that makes any sense. So yes. people dressed up in front of a tree. Rusted, yeah, in front of, <laughs> in front of a exactly. tree. Exactly. It's kind of like a wood. and a wooden wall. It's yeah. like a tomboy in a dress. That's me. Oh, oh I love oh, that. Yeah. Nice. yeah. Get with your pink tool belt. Just don't wear it on the wedding. Okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I was planning on it. We'll carry it on a pillow on the way down. Yeah. The so good. <laughs> is one, is one of those? Did you pick from one of those? I, or do you actually, have? I played around with all of those online, but this is the one I chose. <laughs> Excuse me. Bless, Bless you. you. Bless you. Bless you, Mark. So I loved the wood theme and. Hallmark actually had this little ribbon on there, so I found ribbon just like this. And basically, I really want to make it feel very personalized and very much us, Jason yeah. and I, and, and I want people to feel that way. So I've actually used one of Hallmark's invitations and made it into kind of something bigger and kind of a, I loved this theme of like a message in a bottle. Mm -hmm. And but this you have a is twist on it. a twist. This is in me a message in a bottle. For the digital age, so yeah, 2.0. 2.0. Right <laughs> yeah, it's well, one. Yeah. How, now it's 3.0. What are you Just talking so you know, about? Exactly. So this is actually from customusb.com. It's amazing. It's a message in a bottle, and you put that into your computer, and it'll actually show a little video message Stop that it. Jason and I have made. And we oh have my a gosh. clip of it here. This is so it. cute. <laughs> See that carpenter designer there? That's me, Paige. Well, the Paige American is. I traveled the country building homes and helping families for the past nine years. But now that extreme life is over. Now I have a new life full of wedding planning, taking care of our five very talented pets. But to understand all this, maybe I better back up a few years. Back in 2008, I met this guy. He was part of a group called the Ten Tenors that performed on our season five finale of Extreme Makeover Home Edition. And, oops, I fell for tenor number three. I just want to point out, Jason had better billing. He was up a little bit higher than that. Uh, yeah, he was. Oh, that's what you yeah. noticed? I noticed. He made the video. Oh, he made it? Of course yes, he did. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. But actually, that was just a 40-second oh. clip. Actually, 42-second clip. And you can see the rest of it on our website for Home and Family and my website, pagehemis.com, which goes live today. This is Finally. Yes. Yay. This is amazing. Isn't that genius? Uh, so it's I genius. Love it. So this is how I personalized it. So I've, I've taken the regular... Invitation. I'm going to put that in a box. Whoops. And I'm going to tighten that up. And then on top, I'm going to put this little thing in a box. So when people get it, they're actually going to get this surrounded by the colors that I'm actually going to use the wedding. So 
this is a spoiler alert. There's going to be a little pink, a little brown, some twine, some lace, and some red and white twine as well. Wrap mm -hmm. it up. And now I have to ask you guys, what do you like the best? Which Which one? All different. Different. They're all a little different. Oh, yeah. I like this one, the poofy. I that know. One. I yeah. would probably love that one. one. Is that too I, early? This one, I, go I this love one. it. I like this. I will tell you why I like this one because this is a little bit of you. This is a little bit of him. This is a little bit of country. This is a little. No, I love the, little the bit texture. Of rock and roll. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I was going there. I like this one better. I think this is too frilly. Well, because to you're represent. a guy, of course you'd like that one better. Well, I'm sorry, it takes two to but get all, married. There's a guy involved well, in it. Okay? <laughs> Wait a minute. Like we said before, some go to the girls, some go to the guy. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Right. So right. guys on my list are going to get this one. Yeah. Girls will get this one. Yeah. 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 All, the, like all the girls we would like that. Love that's the best one. So when do you send these out, Debbie? When well, do they go? Okay, so you should send your wedding invitations out six to eight weeks before the wedding. But you should send the save the dates mm. six to eight months before. So you really have to do a lot of pre planning. And if whoops. the destination, well, you yeah, know, it's well, whoops on my part, honey, because yeah. I'm your wedding planner. Whoops, sorry, guys. That was my fault. Yeah. But if it's a destination wedding, which yours is because, you know, so many people are coming from Australia, you should send the invitations out three months before. Okay, so question, not though. too much. Don't you need to put this in a separate box? You can't yes. put it in the mail like this. Nope. No. Yeah. I'll put yeah. it in a separate box. Right. So when somebody opens it, they're going to get a little experience right. of what I they're going to expect on that day. There you go. Wow, that's a hard act to follow. Yeah. Well, you know? <laughs> I know this. We're going to need a lot of tissue because if you guys cry on every <laughs> single DIY yeah, that we, we put up here, right. it's going to be that's troublesome. Right, we are. Well, you you can find, go ahead. If you want to yeah. find the perfect wedding invitation for you, please visit Hallmark.com and keep watching for more wedding planning fun leading up to Paige and Jason's big day on June the 22nd. And don't forget to come. You're invited. All of you are invited. invited. Yes. When we do come back, we're inviting you to spend some time and look behind the scenes at a day in the life of a weatherman. <laughs> Pablo Gomez.